For example, may comma. Let P, X, Y be. X is the capital of Y. Find the truth values of P, Baguio, comma, Baguio City, comma, Philippines. Philippines lang yun. Wala yun ano dito. Oops. Punta doon. Okay. What is the truth value of the first statement? This one. Anyone? False, ma'am. False, false ma'am. Yes, false. Okay. Nga naman false. Okay, Manila. Manila. Capital. Manila is the capital of the Philippines. Yes, yes. Then Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Is this true or false? True. 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 Oo. So, this is another way of writing. Oops. This is another way. Bakit yun? Another way of writing your statement. P, X, Y. P, open parenthesis, comma, X, Y. So, that's another way. Then, we have what we call your quantification. Your quantification is if you have P of X is 3 for all values of X. Example, this one. Ito to. P of X, so ex um, isa kay there exists. So, meron tayong okay, wait. You have there exists P of X existence yan. Um, usually, there exists may X dito. There exists X that the P of X is too. So, that's your existence. Meron tayong for all X P of X is true. Kano? Atong there exist. Pwede rin yun sabihin for some. Gito is for all. For all yun. First statement. For all X, X is less than two. Is this true or false? Anong truth value niyan? For all x, x is less than 2. Anyone? False. False. Hmm? False. Uh, In fact, may dito na sa, ano? Uh, false. Nasa no, screen. No. <laughs> Sinan ko lang kapinitingnan yung screen or hindi kayo nakatingin sa screen. Huh? It is false. Kasi, it's possible ng x niya is less than 2. So, pero pag sabihin nyo for some x, x is less than 2, that will become true. Kung true. For some um, x, and you will have x is less than 2, that will be true. Why? Kasi, di ba, 0 is less than 2. So, meron siya for some x. That will become true. Pero itong for all x, x is less than 2. That is supposed to be false. Pero meron itong natawag na open sentences. Iko na muna i-discuss yun para hindi masyado marami. We have what we call your existence. Okay. Ang next topic is already on methods of proof. Itong methods of proof, yun yung para sa second exam ninyo. So, meron tayong direct, indirect, tapos meron tayong, call this one, uh, hmm, ano pa yan? Yan tayo, mathematical induction, proving by mathematical induction. Which is also given here, existence proof, Ito, saka yung, well, this is the principle of mathematical induction. So, we're going to discuss this, saka yung other methods of proof by Monday. Okay, by Monday. Pero hindi na siya kasali sa exam ninyo on, sa second part na siya next, ano na po siya na exam.